Men's Across looking to make it two in a row, taking on St. John's. Saints facing a team that has received votes for the top 20 national polls. Evenly matched contests throughout. Kyle Curry finding the back of the net to begin the second half. Saints would take a two goal lead. And it looked like the halftime adjustment was working. Just nine seconds later, it's the senior Danny Martinson who gives Siena a three point lead. Danny Martinson on the board again. St. John's would find the lead back though late in the fourth, but Siena would make this an exciting one. Colin Clock would tie it at 11. That completed the hat trick, and we're going to the final minutes. But the Red Storm would be the team to get the final say. Colin Keegan, his fifth of the game, put St. John's up with three minutes to go. Saints had a numerous opportunities, a late surge here, but Jeff Lohman was up for the challenge. Saints edged by St. John's 12 to 11 and falls to one and three overall. Hopefully we come out of it stronger. Uh, we got a quick turnaround to Stony Brook on Tuesday. I think our guys are, are ready to move on quickly from it. Uh, we're going to look at the tape and find out what we can learn from it. And, uh, you know, the, the, we did a lot of great things. We, we need to make sure we're, we're showing them that as well. But, you know, the, we have to continue to get better each week. We've said that since the beginning, and, and we have so far. Uh, the tape's going to show us what we need to get better at for sure.